Raise your hand if you're giving blood. I'll be a spectator to that. <laughs> oh no. Brennan, you're closer. Oh, you look. Welcome to today's vlog. Today's vlog comes to you from my parents' house in Florida. We decided if we were gonna self-isolate and social distance, it'd be a lot easier to do it down here at my parents in Florida where we don't know anyone. They're not here, they're in Pennsylvania. They're like, hey, you can take our house. So we did. So here we are, so you'll see that the next, I don't know how long we're gonna be here, but you'll see that the next few videos at least will be from us in Florida. And we have this beautiful pool that we'll be able to sort of escape the inside and hang out on the outside and um, live our life down here for a while so the kids can do school down here. However, this is my big issue right now is our school ha does not have an online component. So, there's been really no direction or curriculum that's been sent out. So I'm letting the kids take two weeks, um, which is the two weeks of school that they were, um, that we know about now, and just sort of relax and um, come to terms with what's going on. And then after that, we have to start to cobble together some type of schooling. Comment down below, you guys out there, if you have, if your school has an online curriculum, curriculum and something to follow, like if you something to do daily, ours so far does not. So. <laughs> Eh, that should be fun. So I, I don't know if you guys remember, I uh, used to homeschool Kate when she was doing gymnastics. So I'm gonna have to put my teacher hat back on and start that next week. So anyway, um, we hope you enjoy our vlogs from here. We hope you're doing well and we have something cool on the docket today. So stay tuned. See you later. All right, you guys. Hey, good afternoon. We are in the car, Brennan and dad and I. Hello everybody. Hola. Hola. We, I'm pretty excited about what we're doing today, I have to say. I'm, I'm actually very excited. I haven't done it in a long time. If you guys can guess what it is. Okay, I haven't done it in a long time. Probably a year. It's a great way to lose weight. It's a great way to lose weight. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, it's a, my brain's not doing it. It's a good excuse to lay around. Uh -huh. First and foremost, it helps others. You get free cookies. You get free cookies at the end. Free Lorna Dunes. Lorna Dunes, Mike remembers that from when he was younger. Um, you get free apple juice, I remember, uh, when you're done. It takes about a half an hour. The good news is when I do it, it benefits everybody. Uh, ah, I when you do it, who does it benefit? Maybe. Just those people. A few. A few people. Brennan's never done it before. Mm -hmm. uh, How about that? Excellent. Pretty pretty good uh, hints, right? Yeah, excellent. Okay, so this is the deal. We are, we've noticed on the news that there is a call for um, blood. And there's a blood shortage going on because of the situation. And we have decided that it's time, we're, uh, not it's time, we decided today we're gonna go give blood. We said, how Actually, can we help? How, how can we help? In? What can we do? What can we do? Because we're doers. We are doers. And it's, you know what, when you feel helpless, like, like so far, everything is you know we're healthy and happy and you know yes we've been affected by this crisis in many different ways but Brennan can't go to the gym okay Brennan yes but I mean seriously like the economy not so great right now and um you know having to like stop all you're doing like Brendan was supposed to have you know living your life like being able to go to school he's not gonna have SATs now he's not gonna have water polo tournaments he's not gonna have all that kind of stuff that's you know how it affects a teen's life there's we know that there's a lot more going on out there with other people and what's happening with them so our heart goes out to you we pray every day that um, everybody is going to be safe and healthy and that this is going to end soon but anyway feeling helpless is no way to feel so we feel like we can help um, by doing a few things. So we looked at some other volunteer opportunities as well, so stay tuned on those. But for today, we're giving blood. Woo! Yay! Or at least let me say, raise your hand if you're giving blood. I'm gonna try. Okay, Dad's gonna try. Yeah. I'm gonna. I'm definitely giving blood. I'm gonna find a substitute volunteer opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> Brendan wants to do something different because he's a little nervous about giving blood. Dad's gonna try only because he's not sure that he's gonna be able to. He's been doing this new eating routine, which actually means not eating. He's been fasting. Intermittent fasting. Intermittent fasting is what he's calling it. So I'm not sure that they will allow him to give blood, but if he can, he might take Brennan's spot. And if he can't, then Brennan's gonna give blood. Huh? Ah! Huh? Uh, I don't know, we'll see, later, I am. All right, so come with us. If you guys have ever given blood before, you know what this is all about. If you haven't, 
watch how it goes. Uh, we'll try not to make it too gruesome. It's not going to be gruesome, really. No, it's like, yeah. Actually, it's not gruesome at all. It's not gruesome at all. Try it's not, not gruesome. to throw up. Try not to what? Throw up. Yeah, try not to throw up. <laughs> all right. Stay tuned, guys. Blood drives and things have been shut down and canceled. Like school's been canceled and work's been canceled and those kinds of things, so they're not getting blood in the other blood drives. So there, so this blood is for people who are, you know, have other issues that they need blood. That their blood shortage is going on because of things have been canceled because of COVID nineteen. So anyway, so if you want to give blood, please, and you're eligible, please go ahead and do it. They are desperate. All right, you guys, I'm done. Look at that. So they wrapped me up, and I, my thing is that I am supposed to just take it easy the rest of the day, and they said no strenuous activity, lifting, exercise, anything like that, and what else? Hmm. Drink extra glasses of water, and if I don't feel well, well over the next two weeks, I'm supposed to call them and let them know because we don't want to pass on any... Like if I were, were to have the flu, we don't want to pass it on to anybody else. So it was a pretty easy process. I highly recommend it. And um, I'll talk to Brennan about it later. I think Brennan, Brennan and Mike, I think are going to come next week um, after Mike has started eating again. And um, Brennan's going to forego a day of exercise so he can <laughs> donate, which is awesome. All right, I got my V8 juice. Thank you. I always say that when I'm donating blood, I always want to drink tomato juice or V8 juice because I almost feel like I'm putting the blood back in. <laughs> that sounds really, really weird, but that's me. All right, Brendan, so you saw the process. What do you think? Trust the process. Yeah, not really that bad, right? Mm -hmm. Excellent. So let me tell you what they told me in there. What? So the blood is not for the coronavirus patients. Do you know what it's for? Mm -hmm. Listen, no, this is the deal. It's because, you know, they have blood drives, um, you know, like this place probably has blood drives, you know, every week at some different school or place of work or whatever. Right. And the schools and the churches and the place of business are shut down. So this blood is what they need for the regular, you know, people who are, yeah, surgeries. Mm -hmm. People so who are being treated in the hospital. You were trying to say that it was to help people who have coronavirus. I thought so. Is not true because if you get a regular flu, which is like similar symptoms to coronavirus, you don't. Right, and I didn't, I didn't realize that. I, I mean, obviously, I realized. I was thinking that after some of it's all good. We're just trying yeah. to try and help people. That's all. Yeah. It's all good. It's all good. Good job, Jillian. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Actually, you. Feel better. I do feel good about your contribution. I feel good about my contribution. Yes, I'm happy to help in any way that I can. Great. Good job, and uh, thanks, Brennan. I'm Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. I'm looking forward to you guys joining if that's what you want to do. All right. Let's uh, see you later, you guys. So listen, if you guys want to donate, go ahead and look up a donation center near you. There's doesn't the American, cost anything. It doesn't cost anything. Just a little bit of time. You get free V8 juice at the end if you want. They had donuts there and pizza, but I didn't really, I wasn't <sighs> going to jump in on that. Yes, I'm good. So if you do that, um, think of ways also that you can help out in your community. We're going to take a look at the local food bank. Brennan and, and pizza boy. He did! He ate my pizza! No, I didn't. Did he? Oh. He ate an entire... <laughs> 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 
<laughs> that's awesome. Oh, so you didn't grab the piece for me. Oh my gosh. We're going to in. Oh, that's right. Talk to me. Yes, we are. Okay. So, okay. So, okay. Just so if you guys remember, Brennan, look at you back there. Okay. So Mike and Brennan have been in a contest of who can get to 150 pounds. 55. No, 55 pounds first. Mike is losing weight and Brennan is trying to gain weight. Need, so they're going to go weigh in. I need weight gain plans the for skin. you guys. If you guys can like reach out. <laughs> Done it. Tell you how to gain weight. Somebody oh, wait, did comment wait. below. I don't know if it's Somebody more beneficial commented. to eat a lot and do minimal activity or eat a lot and do uh, lots of activity. So right. below. DM me <laughs> with your plans for how to gain weight. Please. Thank you. And um DM you on how to gain Send me some no recipes or food. <laughs> Just pray for Mike. <laughs> That's awesome. All right, so we're going to go weigh you guys in. We're going for the weigh in. We just tried uh, in one place and the uh, scale wasn't accurate. So we're going to go get the accurate. It was four and a half pounds off. Real feel. Oh. No on it and it said four and a half pounds. Okay. Oh, she said if I feel dizzy, I should put my feet up. I'm feeling a little bit dizzy. Oh. Um, the reason, did we already explain? Maybe something if you just went. I know. <laughs> well, did we explain why Katie and Ryan weren't with us? Oh, Katie and Ryan are not with us because Katie and Ryan are not old enough to donate blood. So Brendan was a possibility. They are not. So they stayed Why home. Why they just come with us? Because it's not worth moving their germs all over the joint. That's right. Yeah. So you know what I'm saying? Moving my germs? We almost well, because you almost were going to donate. <clears throat> all right. Let's go weigh you guys in. Good luck to both chicken. of you. Actually, yeah. I might just eat popcorn and chicken though. Gain weight. Oh, that's a good idea. I might get a smoothie mm. if they have it at the grocery store. Bye. Taking my watch off. Oh, that's a good idea. You wouldn't want to. You first. Okay. Good luck. I want to check this. No, what are you doing? That, no, that's your blood pressure. Here we go. Oh, shoes off. Wait. Oh. <laughs> oh no. What does it say? One sixty-three and a half. Okay, so you have five, this is at eight and a half pounds. I can eat eight and a half, one, six, three and a half. <laughs> Give me that. <laughs> Brennan just took everything the dad took off and put it in his pocket. That was smart, Brennan. <laughs> what else is in there? Um, <laughs> I want my dad's phone. One, six, three. <laughs> He's pushing it down. <laughs> 260. Let go. Uh, let go. Let go. 147. Oh my gosh, you guys are still in a tie. 147. So wait, you're eight and a half pounds and he is seven pounds. Well, he's closer than you. Brennan, you're closer. How much do you weigh? 163 and a half. Brennan, somebody commented in one of our videos that you should just eat a ton of bagels. Apparently bagels, like, they just put on all kinds of weight. Eight and a half off. Right. Is that right? Oh, bummer. Let's go. Turn me up. I'm a half pound off. All right, Mike's a half pound out. All right, we got our groceries. Brennan's in the lead. He's in ah. chicken and. But we're all moving closer. We're we all are, moving we closer. We are getting closer. We are moving closer. All right, guys, that's what our days consist of these days. So give it oh, a yeah. lot and. Weighing each other and <laughs> trying to do a little grocery shopping. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing coronavirus. Uh, yeah, so actually, we are blessed though that this is what our days are consisting of. And shout out and prayers, prayers for all those yes who are struggling. And um, we'll get through this together. So thanks so much for watching. We hope you enjoyed our video. And um, stay safe out there. Stay safe out there. That's exactly right. We'll Not see you guys. We'll see you guys tomorrow. God bless. God bless.